My name is Vasundara. I love traveling. My interest in cooking started when I moved overseas and I couldn't get the food that I wanted to eat. Somehow being overseas makes you feel more Singaporean as well. I realized that the memories from my grandma's kitchen in Juchet were more important to me than I had given them credit for. So the area that we lived in was predominantly Pranakan Chinese. Further down, there was the Batang place. I could smell the bamboo leaves steaming. It was a very interesting experience growing up because it was such a multi-ethnic community. My grandma, she sold thosai and chutney from the back of her house. Every morning, I ate thosai and idli. Thosai is a fermented batter that's made into something like a crepe or a pancake. It's traditional breakfast, South Indian breakfast. I think where cultures mingle, you have many, many new ideas. So I've married what my grandfather brought from India with the influences here in Singapore. I chose to add black glutinous rice, pulo hitam, an ingredient that's used a lot in Southeast Asian cooking. I serve it with a coconut chutney, which is traditionally Indian. But I also serve it with a salad which is inspired by the Malay karabu. There's grated coconut and there's fresh elements like coriander, leaves and mint. And it's reflective of what's usually grown in the kampongs in the past. All together when you eat it with the dosa, it's fresh. So it's actually a textural explosion in your mouth, but also very healthy. Asian fermentation is a big part of heritage. If people are making sourdoughs, I think we should try making thosai.